Good afternoon. I'm Mike Peterson, and here's the latest from the KMA Newsroom on this Wednesday afternoon. Red Oak officials are laying the groundwork for filling two of its top administrative positions. Meeting in special session Tuesday afternoon, the Red Oak City Council acknowledged the retirements of City Administrator Brad Wright and City Clerk Mary Bolton, which were submitted late last week. Now, the resignations aren't effective until the end of the year, per their retirement letters. Their last two days in office are December 5th and 2nd due to accumulated vacation time. Like many across the state, Mills County Conservation District officials are beginning to put together a long-term outlook for conservation efforts in the county. That's why the County Soil and Water Conservation District is holding a public hearing this afternoon at the Classic Cafe at Malvern at 1 p.m. Kara Morgan is Executive Director of Golden Hills Resource Conservation and Development. This group was contacted by the Conservation Districts of Iowa to facilitate this hearing. She tells KMA News the meeting serves as an opportunity to receive input from the public and landowners as the Conservation District formulates a roughly five-year outlook. Also this afternoon, Iowa Lieutenant Governor Adam Gregg is making a stop in Clarinda to meet with city officials and the Clarinda Chamber of Commerce. We'll have coverage on that event later on on KMA News this afternoon. And Glenwood School officials are moving ahead with the final piece of its massive expansion and renovation project. We talked to Glenwood Superintendent Dr. Devin Embre about the letting of bids and the awarding of contracts for the stadium and track renovations this morning. KMA on track weather, mostly cloudy this afternoon, highs in the low 30s, some increasing clouds this tonight with a low in the upper teens. More news at 1205, 105, 505, and 605, and of course, more news online at kmaland.com. Have yourself a good Wednesday. Mike Peterson, so long, my friend.